So I'll be speaking about some A and P of skin to skin, and mainly what benefits researchers have found from this. Um, so skin to skin care has been known to effectively calm a crying baby, and researchers have shown that newborns who are separated experience ten times the number of cries than those who experience skin to skin care. Frantic crying has been shown to impair lung function, increase the intracranial pressure, and can jeopardise the closure of the foramen ovale. This is due to stress hormones, um, which cause vasoconstriction, um, which puts more pressure on the body. Um, and they found that in turn, um, babies who receive skin to skin care, um, so they have a decreased stress response, therefore um, they don't experience fight or flight. Um, which in turn decreases vasoconstriction and aids transition. Um, skin to skin care has demonstrated a heart rate of three beats per minute slower and the same with respiratory rate of three less per minute. Furthermore, skin to skin care aids thermoregulation and in turn temperature is actually linked to hypoglycemia because as the body cools, the sympathetic system becomes more active and noroepinephrine is released. This causes vasoconstriction and increased anaerobic metabolism. Um, due to the excess lactic acid, the lungs and heart of the newborn now have to work harder and can deplete the glucose stores that they had in the body. Therefore, skin to skin reduces the activity of the sympathetic nervous system, which is fight or flight. And that aids the transition to extra uterine life because it reduces the stress hormones in the newborn, such as cortisol and norepinephrine. And this allows better control over heart rate and thermoregulation, which aids um, a less complicated and stress-free uh, transition to extra uterine life.